Thank you for visiting the uh, video. This is a 1977 Santana Land Rover. They're made in Spain. Um, a diesel, 88 inch short wheelbase. A one company owned, which was the Cangas de Narcia, which is uh, a, munici uh, a municipal. Uh, we were in the UK. We would call it council. Uh, it's an environment vehicle, and I was uh, uh, I was made aware in 1977 this was their only new vehicle, which is fabulous. They've had it forever. It's been used by everybody from uh, building sites to surveyors to going up the mountains, going down rivers. It's absolutely fabulous. It's a total original alloy bodied. Land Rover 88 Series 3. I have personally just driven it 2,240 miles in three days from Spain back to the UK and it's in its working clothes. It isn't full of Bondo. It's, most panels are dented and they're original. I estimate eight hours per panel so I can I can get the panel straight for you, but it's eight hours labor, labor per panel. No panels need to be changed. No panels have ever been changed. Uh, the seats are fabulous. I have I've never seen these seats. Uh, they are proper Santana seats. Very very comfortable. Uh, quite high up on the foam. So if you if you're tall, I'm six foot three. If you're tall, you have. Um, you do you do go quite close to the steering wheel if you're short even better but the backrests are fabulous uh, i do like original santana seats they're much better than the brick part or any uh, or any sort of trim company in the uk which sell replacement replacement interiors you would much much better off getting these uh, recovered you'd be a lot happier as you can see, it's just absolutely in its working clothes. It's got the full headlining, and it's got the uh, the four vents, as well as the uh, safari safari windows. It's had a big roof rack on at one point, as you can see where the uh, where the roof rack used to go. Uh, it's a steel roof, and it's a safari roof. It has the twin uh, the twin um, the twin roof for the heat. Uh, had a new exhaust on a couple of weeks ago. Uh, wheels are round and black. You can always get a choice of wheels with uh, with with the twin. Uh, the back. I'll just open the back up. All the doors lock. Comes with a spare wheel. Um, very nice original thing. They can be a seven seater, five seater, three seater, whatever seater. You uh, buyer wishes really um, obviously got the tow bar because I'm just moving the um, the horse box about the gardeners in today cutting the grass and you can see there's no rot on the back door which is very uh, very unusual for this model uh, just go around the back and go around to this side this is hand done it's fabulous even if I was to restore this, which is an option, I'd still like to keep that and lacquer over it. It's just fabulous. And what looks like uh, rubber bullets. Uh, uh, we're, we're having a debate what that, what that issue is. Uh, some say it, it's, it's had a chain around it, a chain's hit it, and it looks like rubber bullets, but it's all part of its character and its history. Um, I'll just go in now and you can just see the seats are, the seats come apart so you've got a top and a bottom All, always there's a top and a bottom so the seats come apart I'll just bang that there and we're just going to start it like normal um, it has been used today so we won't need too much heat and it'll tick over nice and slow I've had a very, very nice drive in it. Just start straight away. 
we'll go out and very, very low on the tick over which I wanted to show you because very low on the tick over means uh, if it's going to if it's going to smoke, it's going to smoke a very low on the tick over. And as you can see, I haven't seen a, a puff of smoke out of the thing in over 2,000 miles. We'll just open the bonnet so you can see the bonnet. Bear with me just a second. I'll take the pin out so the bonnet goes right back. Not many people know that the Land Rover bonnet goes right back, but if you are servicing your vehicle, always use a bungee onto the roof just for safety because uh, the pin really hurts when it goes through your head this is a, a two and a two and a quarter diesel uh, same as a Land Rover Series 3 but Sun Santana have a better air filter and a, a better fuel pump system however ordinary Land Rover fuel pump fits just the Spanish tend to uh, want to use their own. It has boost brakes. Uh, brakes are a Land Rover. Uh, it still brakes but uh, they're not modern. Um, but there's nothing wrong with the brakes. They're just not modern. And I'm going to put the tick over up. It has a cruise control or hand, hand PTO. And we'll take it up one. And you'll also notice it's got a nice heater in it as well was always an option. Quite a nice thing. Uh, mileage is 124,000 kilometers and I've just I've just done several of those. Uh, it has a wireless in. Um, so uh, 124 would be about 86,000 miles. Um, one one municipal company owned which I mean I don't think they're going to uh, they're going to clock the vehicle. Uh, such a nice, pleasant thing to own. A couple of things I noticed, getting away from it a bit, a couple of things I noticed, there is a uh, uh, alternator belt once changing, but well, rightly so, it's just done 2,000 miles in, in three days. Um, uh, uh, oils are fresh, clean, uh, Yago, my friend, did them before. Uh, tires are not matched got Defender on the front and old Series 3 on the back. Again, I always give an option. Uh, these don't suit alloy wheels, but they do suit the Wolf wheels or the early uh, Discovery steel wheels, which I always keep, a, a, keep a, an abundance of. Um, I can sell it as is, or I can sell it restored. I don't do anything in between. Chassis is perfect. There's nothing wrong with the chassis whatsoever. This comes from Northern Spain, they don't have any salt on the roads, they can't afford the salt on the roads. Um, invariably they normally don't have a tow bar, but obviously this one being a municipal vehicle, this has a nice big hefty tow bar. As you can see, it does everything. Big old hefty thing and a big old hefty thing for the spare wheel. It does come with a spare wheel obviously. I've just taken it off. Um, just a fabulous thing. I hope you approve of it. Uh, give me, uh, do give me a call. Um, www.vtwin.com. My name's Mark Nolan. Uh, I'm here to help. We have global shipping numbers, so uh, shipping around the world is very easy for us. Uh, we're a trusted member of the shipping community, so um, you know, see what you think. Um, I listen, but I'll either fully restore it or I'll sell it as is. I would not hesitate to use this as is. I would want to uh, put a match set of tires on if I was going to use it as an everyday vehicle, but I would not hesitate to use it as an everyday vehicle. I quite like the batana of the few dents, but uh, if, you, if you do want to restore, you know, do talk to me and I'll give you a quote. Uh, but beware, I do not do half a job. Um, let the other people do that. Thank you.